This year's Senior PGA Championship took place at the stunning French Lick Resort in southern Indiana, USA. The Pete Dye design course played host to a competition with an almost unparalleled roll call of previous winners. After a fantastic victory in 2014 at his first attempt, Colin Montgomery was back to defend his title. The Scot played some majestic golf around the narrow, undulating fairways of French Lick, winning by four strokes on a course he'd never played competitive golf on before. It is strange to come uh, defending a title and, and you're not at the same venue. It is, it is slightly strange, but majors aren't always played at the same venue, so you, so you put up with that. And, uh, it's great to, uh, to come to a new venue and, uh, and to finish on top of the leaderboard. I think uh, I used my patience, I used my experience. I was glad today that I was playing with Bernhard Langer. We're very close and, I, and I've always learned from Bernhard Langer uh, in the way that he goes around the course. He doubled, he doubled Bobby the second today. Most unlucky, the ball came up against a bunker and it was just an impossible lie. And he walked onto the third tee and you wouldn't have known I like playing with him that way. He gives me that sense of uh, uh, calmness that I, that I require. And that calmness saw Monty comfortably defend his lead throughout the final day. Three ahead, you've got to be, you know, you're in a position where you're, 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 you're comfortable. It, it was sort of in my hands. If I could score level par, which I thought was the, the goal, 18 pars, and it would have been enough. I was playing well enough to be able to think I could do that. Then you start off with a three-putt bogey in the first. You think, oh, God, here we go. And then I managed to get some birdies coming, coming, coming in. But uh, around the turn is where things switched. But, yeah, three ahead, level par should be enough. I can, I can usually cope with that. Uh, but around this course, uh, for those of you who want to play this course, who are of average 18 handicap, there's a potential problem around every corner, and uh, including ourselves. Famous for its severe runoff areas, tight fairways and sharp dog legs, French Lick is a serious test of golf. The seniors found themselves fighting the course as much as each other, with patience and concentration the key to success. I enjoyed the golf course, to be honest. I did. I enjoyed uh, the challenge of it. Uh, never mind having to play against another 155 competitors, but the challenge of playing against the golf course was more that I was attuned with. Uh, I didn't watch the leaderboards as much as I used to do or, or I normally do. I was more involved in trying to play chess with the golf course and find my way around. There is a way around here uh, and you've got to find it and that's what I was trying to do. Entering a tournament as the reigning champion always comes with its own unique combination of pressure and responsibility. But this was a win that never seemed in doubt, with Monty a picture of calm throughout the day. Once you've done it once, that's the hard bit. Doing it again, knowing you can do it again. I think the confidence, it's all up here. The, the golf, anyone that's played any level of golf would understand that uh, if you believe and you trust in your own ability, you can succeed. It's when we start not believing in ourselves and second-guessing ourselves that the problems arise. So having won it already gave me that confidence and that ability to say, yes, I can do this. Since qualifying for the senior circuit, Monty has enjoyed great success, claiming six wins, including three majors. Victories at this level of competition have breathed a new lease of life into his game. It means a lot to me. You know, the first three tournaments that I've won on the Champions Tour have been majors. And there's one person that's done that, and that's Jack Nicholas. Now, any time that you equal anything to do with the word Jack Nicholas in golf, you, you become very honored, and, uh, 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 and I am. So, uh, delighted. Uh, I do like the Champions Tour. I've often said that. Uh, the crowds have embraced me. Uh, I've embraced them, and uh, I'm enjoying it, and I think great believer, as I probably said last year, if you enjoy something, you're usually quite good at it. And I enjoy what I do here. Next season, the tournament moves back to last year's venue, Harbour Shore on the banks of Lake Michigan, where Monty won his first senior PGA championship. It will be hard to look beyond the Scott repeating that feat and claiming a third title in a row.
Well, it's never been done before, I believe, and so, so you know, there's, there's, there's history uh, 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 beckoning, but at the same time, yes, I like the golf course. Tom Watson said that I was the favourite going into it because of the way that the course was set up, and I agreed with him. Uh, at the same time, uh, uh, there are dangers around that course like no other, so very difficult. The, the competition on the Champions Tour is very high. There's 156 guys starting here that uh, all fancy their chances, uh, so it's going to be difficult by all means, but we'll see what happens.